Greetings, Rijo Agatides here. Most general types in battle operation are, with a lack of a better word, general. You can almost always expect them to have a staggering shot like a beam rifle or a bazooka, a two-hit melee combo, and minor variations to how tanky they are or how many emergency evasions they can do. Or the addition of one or two exotic weapons or systems, but most of the time they're really just a thing at the front, staying alive to keep enemies away. Bar a few exceptions, but they still do the same thing, just while killing everyone else. But the suit for today is completely different. This is the 600 cost general type Dovin Wolf. And almost nothing about the Dovin Wolf is a general type. First, you have the weapons. There are a lot on the Dovin Wolf. The main weapon is a beam rifle, but with close to no stagger uncharged and a normal stagger after a charge time of 4 long seconds, it does not have the handling of a general type beam rifle, and certainly not for starting melee combos. Then you have the beam cannon. More like a support type of weapon, it staggers instantly, fires far, but you have to stand still to fire. The only weapon to stagger instantly at range on the Dovin Wolf, you don't want to overheat them as you have nothing to stagger instantly for 20 seconds. Not very... Very rude of the Lange Bruno cannon to interrupt us like that. Before we continue on the list of weapons, we now have a favor to return. With our own Mega Beam Launcher. Yep, the Dovin Wolf is a general type and it has a Mega Beam Launcher like a support type. With a charge time of 10 seconds, it takes a bit of setup, which is why we respond dangerously early. Definitely wait for teammates to respond together any other time. Range adjusted. Fire! Flying in a straight line is the last thing you want to do when someone is charging a big ass cannon. Half the rate type gone before the fight even begins. Now where was I on the long list of weapons? Ah yes, the beam cannons. Other than that, and obviously the mega beam launcher, there's also a 12 shot missile launcher that has to be fired while standing still. They also fire vertically up before heading to the target, so make sure you aim 3 jamu fins ahead. Now before I continue introducing the other half of the weapons, we need to scram. The last thing we want to do is die alone from full health. With the Atlas taking the enemy attention, we won't let him die in vain. The Dovin Wolf is not fast, but there's one skill borderline broken up his sleep. Shock Absorbers. Shock Absorbers allow the Dovin Wolf to ignore all instant staggers, be it beam, ballistic, or even melee. Just like having maneuver armor at all times, the Dovin Wolf is hard to stop. And with that, we matched our team's respawn perfectly. But this does not come at no cost. The Dovin Wolf has plenty of weak points. First as I've said, it is not fast. The movement speed of the Dovin Wolf is nothing close to other 600 cost general types, nor is the thruster capacity. Secondly, unlike the other general types, it does not have emergency evasion, nor does it have melee combo controller. To add salt to the wound, the Dovin Wolf has little melee defense, making it even weaker in melee fights. A mega beam launcher, shock absorbers, slow moving and little melee defense, does that sound like a certain support type mobile suit? That being said, unlike the Zark, the Dovin Wolf has way less health than normal only around 3 quarters of a normal general type, so we certainly aren't as indomitable as the Zark. Repaired most of the suit but we still only get 14k health, saying that the Dovin Wolf has paper armor isn't that far from the truth, but it certainly comes with some serious firepower. Someone seemed to have not learned his lesson. Painting your Zeta Plus the color of the support type version won't make us aim at anyone else. Finally, more time to talk about the weapons. Five minutes into the game and we still have three more weapons to introduce, and they all can be used while on thrusters. First, you have the Vulcans. They are a complete joke, don't use them. Then you have the Incoms, which you may have seen me use already. Just like Funnels, Lock On, Release, and you can forget about them as they do their thing. Two uses before overheating, they are crucial to keeping the pressure on on the Dovin Wolf. 
especially when you don't want to poke your head out. The incomes also stagger if all four shots hit. Not reliable in that sense, but worth a shot when you don't want to stagger teammates in a brawl. The range on them are limited though, which is why standing all the way back is not a good idea on this suit. Not much health left, time to use the final weapon, the spread beam gun. Firing 8 shots for 35% stagger each, there's literally nothing it cannot stop while you're charging in with shock absorbers. Take this final down attack. Final respawn. One minute left on the clock so we can play more aggressively, but not too much since the Dovin Wolf could use a fragile sign on it. Rate type flyby and no longer. Thank you for the free damage every time. Ready to annihilate the Gelgook next. Failed the swap to the beam gun thanks to the key bindings all the way to 8. Doesn't matter since our rate type finishes him before us. If he was an enemy, I am sure we're already dead. Win already in the bag, 15k health left, what can possibly go wrong? Missed the beam rifle shot, but the beam cannon lands, setting up for our rate type charge attack, but then there's the longer Bruno again! Going from safe to a pinch took one second only, but not over yet, there's still one thing to show, the Dovin Wolf special counter! Neat game with us topping damage. The Dovin Wolf is a general type by name, but more a support type by nature. You need to do something of both worlds, staying far enough back to avoid unwanted attention and not get melted, but close enough that you can use the spread beam gun and incom sometimes. An awkward setup that depending on the situation is either the best general type and support type, or the worst of both at the same time. Certainly a difficult suit to use. That's it from me today. Latest.